What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We just sold out Jazbees 35 box, 164 hit baseball mixer, random teams that have featured some flawless, some hit parade, and more, of course. So, again, 30 total spots, all cards shipped. This mixer includes one box of flawless baseball, a 10 box case of limited hit parade baseball, a 12 box case of 2021 Pro Set Metal baseball, and 2021 Leaf Metal Hobby baseball. Leaf Metal Draft, I should say. It's right there. So there you go, guys. And again, here's a dice roll. Here's a customer in A. So, Chris, so if you have no character sign at the end that says contenders, contend one and two, that means you bought those spots straight up. So we really appreciate it. Um, and then for everybody else, of course, that means you won those in a pack filler, which was contenders. So we appreciate that as well for buying in on that. Roll it. We got ourselves a four and a six ten times. Good luck. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. TJ down to Joe Vent. I have four and a six, ten times. Let's paste in the teams. One, two, three, four, five. Six and it was a ten, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oakland A's down to the Tampa Bay Rays. All right, A's for TJ. Michael with the Angels. Anthony with the Cardinals. Matthew with the Braves last one. Well, Jamar with the D-backs. Aaron with the Yankees. Marlon with the Padres. Bobby of the Red Sox. Marlon with the Marlins. Michael with the Blue Jays. Joe with the Nationals. Marlon with the Royals, Twins, and Guardians. Michael with the Seattle Mariners. Uh, Kevin with the Pirates. Marlon with the Giants. Steven with the White Sox. Michael with the Mets. Marlon with the Dodgers. Brandon with the Phillies. Kevin with the Cubs. Bobby with the Reds. Marlon with the Tigers, Orioles. Benny with the Rangers. Chris with the Milwaukee Brewers. Jose with the Astros, Marvin with the Rockies, and Joe Van with the race. So I'm going to pause the video, um, see if there's any trades, and if there's no trades by the time I uh, get back, or by the time we trade windows close, we'll start the video again, and we'll uh, we'll start the break, guys. Appreciate it. All right, welcome back, guys. No trades, but uh, we have some little trade chatter. Now, here's the first break we're going to do. We're going to do Leaf Metal Draft. There's the checklist to go by. So we're going to go by specifically that checklist there. And uh, there's the case. And again, no trades. So everybody look at the thing right there again. So again, this break would be pretty fast if, if it had obviously team names on the back, at least like Panini products. But... Since it doesn't, we're going to need to tag all of these for the shipping team. So, bear with me, guys. I think I'm going to also open up all the boxes just to get them out of the way. So, we'll just leave the cards in a uh, little, little slider box that it comes in. And then we'll go through the hits.
few more boxes, guys. Whoa. That looks like a printing plate or something. Alright, there's the 12 boxes right there. Um, it's not a bit off, Kev. It's just that uh, there's a case right in front of it. So, that's why you can't see it. But don't worry, obviously, we're not hiding anything. You guys have the camera face right here. It's just, there's a bunch of cases all around here. Don't pay attention to that one, I should say, I guess. <laughs> Alright guys, Joe Mack, stay pride. I'm gonna quickly topple these and go through these and then we'll go look up and see what teams are on if we don't recognize them right away. That is 13 out of 35. We got Matt Nelson. Future Stars, 3 out of 5. Chase Petty. Jordan Walker, I believe he's a St. Louis Cardinals prospect. 8 out of 10. We have uh, Drew Gray. And Trey Sweeney. Look these ones up really quick. Trey Sweeney is a Yankee. Drew Gray is a Chicago Cub. Walker is a cardinal, as I said. Hello, Willie. How are you, man? I'm doing well. How are you? Chase Petty is a Minnesota twin. Nelson's a Cincinnati Red. So that's a try to trade, couldn't trade mojo for Bobby. Cincinnati Reds right there with that out of five, Matt Nelson. And Joe Mag is this uh, Miami Marlin. All right, so there you go. All the teams right there, what it goes out to. Let's continue on with the next box. So like I said, it's going to be a little time consuming just because we have to tag all of these teams that their players are on. But, you know, once we get done with these two first cases, we should be pretty quick with the rest.
That's awesome, man. All right, Nick Gonzalez. Aaron Zavala. That's number three out of five. Nick is not numbered. We have Roberto Campos at a 10. Brock Selvage. We have a Brett Batty. And you have a redemption of Jack Later. And let's see who these go to. Rangers for the redemption. So Texas, that's going to Bennett Page. Yeah, I know Pirates was Nick Gonzalez. But I'm just going to do it all at once. I did not, William. I did not, man. I haven't played MLB The Show in years. I mean, I haven't played video games in a while, to be honest. Zavala's Rangers. Gonzalez Pirates. Combos is Tigers. Selvage is Yankees. I wonder if Shohei Otani actually plays the show. Brad Batty's Mets. All right, there we go. So there's those tags right there. Next box. Harry Ford, which I believe is Seattle Mariners prospect. Brian Acuna, is he? Did he get signed with the Atlanta Braves? I mean, yeah, right or no? I know Luis Angel is Texas. Ian Lewis Jr. to ten. Max Muncie, is this really Max Muncie or is this another Max Muncie? <laughs> Four to ten. Viscano. Number to 25, and Khalil Watson. 
Future Stars. <clears throat> well, I think Showtime, if I had a more of a career year type of uh, deal, big league wide, I mean, he took the MLB by storm this year when he was healthy, so. I mean, either one could have been great, but I feel like Otani. Doing what he did last year, of course, is the more popular one right now. All right, so Harry Ford, just to confirm, I believe is Seattle. Yes, Mariners. With that one. Brian Acuna is under none, actually. So that'll be randomized to one person at the end of the break. Ian Lewis is a Marlin. Max Muncy is the athletic. Cubs for Viscano. Cleo Watson is a Marlin. All right, cool, yeah. Next one. <laughs> Nolan Gorman. Five of five. Matt McClain. Out of 15. Carter Jensen. Owen Cassie. Noah Miller. And look at that. Another try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo, Marcelo Mayer. Or Marcelo Mayer. That is a uh, one out of ten. Bobby trying to trade away the Boston Red Sox, and look at that. This got on a Mayer. Top picks number four. Jazzy J, what's going on? How are you? What's popping? Brand new whip just hopped in. I got options. What's up, Ryan? I know, right? Man, it would have been so much better if you were in the live when that happened. That's probably the best break in a long time, right? Jensen's a Kansas City Royal. Owen's a Cub. No 
Oh, Miller's a Minnesota twin. Vladdy winning the Triple Crown? Wow. Put that in already, Michael. Put that in in the, in the betting world. Angel Martinez, three of three. Joshua Baez. Michael Harris. Derek Curiel. We got Andrew Abbott. That is true, he was there last year. Ooh, and Jason Dominguez. We know that already. Yankees, Aaron Billingsley. Of course, depending on when you send it in, you could get a numbered card or a base card. doesn't matter. Something. New York Yankees right there. Yeah, I think for the most part, I mean, unless Lubob is in the checklist, I think you almost got, like, you got... You know, you got Madrigal. You got a Brave. You know, I, th I think you did pretty well. Oh, Eloy, that's right. We got, forgot about Jimenez. That's right. Eloy was in there, too. <laughs> Cleveland Gardens for Martinez. Joshua's the St. Louis Cardinal. Michael Harris is a brave. None for Derek, so that's another none. for Andrew. No, I, I honestly don't really bet too much, man. If I ever do, it's only really during football season. The pickums and, you know, parlays and shit like that. Uh, occasionally I do hockey, but I do more like draft. Like draft kings, draft, you know, like fantasy type deals. And there we go. Alright, almost halfway through, guys. Like I said, this break was going to be the most time-consuming. We're already at 30 minutes alone, and we, you know, have taken like 20 minutes with this. So, like I said, the Pro Set stuff was going to take a while, or the Leaf products were going to take a while. But the rest, 
Flawless should be like five minutes. Uh, limited should be like another ten. So if we do go over, guys, obviously the times will adjust. Uh, Giordani Ventura, five of five. Jordan Wicks, Steve Hajar, Sam Botrin, Michael McGreevy, Zach Veen, and Oscar Colas. So I think we're going to do the same thing. He might be under a nun, but he was a bigger prospect that's, I believe, now signed. And I can double check these two for the nuns in case they've already been signed. Unless they updated it here already. But see, that's the crazy thing. Group break checklist usually does update pretty fast. You know, so that's why last week when we had that whole little uh, Colos thing, you know, we were just like, well, now he's signed. It's more like a college rules type of deal. But I'll look up those other two on nuns. If they're actually on a team, we'll give those to the specific team too. White Sox. So that White Sox is Steven. Yeah, I know, Michael. And the one thing is that when we were breaking the optic last week, we had a big old little controversy. But um, same thing on group break. You know, Nick Nick said, you know what? At the time, he was a nun. But the only reason why he was a nun is because he hadn't signed with anybody. You know, so it's the same thing. And I know Nick would probably do the same thing. Because like, he's a bigger prospect, I should say. Because usually the last card is a bigger prospect. Now, these guys were like right in the front. They may be on a team now. They may not be. So I'll double check these ones. Well, not that one. But these two over here. But it's the same thing, yeah. It's just more like it should be treated as college rules for that specific thing. Now, of course, you know, for other sports and stuff like that, depending on how the situation is, it's a little different. But, you know. I think that's what we should make clear. It's like for the prospects for big baseball and stuff. It's like they're, if they're only a nun, it's because they haven't signed with anybody yet. I'm a Grievy Cardinals. So crazy it took so long signing with some team though, right? I feel like he was able to sign with somebody like all of last year, but didn't do it. Unless nobody wanted to sign him. Sam Botchman. Which is Angels. LAA. Which is going to Michael. There you go, Angels. Steve Hajar. Hajar is a Michigan pitcher in college? Is that how you say it? Hajar? Twins with that one. Jordan Wicks. Oh, well, there you go. See, in that case, George, he would still stay a nun, right? Because he's in high school. That's the one thing about all of these, like, non-licensed products, you know? It's always a little tricky. I do love, though, that, like, Leaf does like this kind of product, though, because first glance, right, you might get, like, a dude in high school, you know? If you become somebody great, then shit. But actually, you know what's like actually funnier, guys, is that if Group Break Checklist never existed, we'd go by Cardboard Connection because that's really the most official. <laughs> Basically, all the companies send it to Cardboard Connection or, you know, they get the official checklist and send it to them. Uh, but the guy that created a Group Break Checklist is a really cool dude. Um, he, like, made it easier for breakers, but at the same time, kind of made it a little complicated because now, like... You know, 
if he doesn't update it, you know, or something like that, or some, something like that happens, then you'll have, like, a, a nun on this side, but you might have, like, a... He's on the White Talks this time, you know what I mean? Like, in newer products now. So it's, like... It's a little controversy sometimes. I try to go with... With Carbo Connection the most. But but Group Break Checklist is a great pro, uh, great website because he separates by team already for you. And you don't have to go scrolling through the pages having to look. Veen's a Rocky. But yeah, if we were just going... If, there, if, if Group Break Checklist never existed, then we'd go by Carbo Connection, which then again would go by College Rules. Teams are currently on or teams they play for the longest. So that's kind of a little bit of the downside of it. Is LSU a good baseball school? All right, we have National Pride. One of one printing plate of Hyro Palmeiras. John Rhodes. Three out of four. Isaac Pacheco. I mean, I grew up here in Southern California. I don't really watch too much college baseball, but I feel like growing up, like, you know, schools here, like Fullerton and those guys over here were always really good. California schools. Edward Perez. Pacheco should be a Detroit uh, Tiger, too. Mosacato should be a Royal. He's a great pitcher. I think he was, like, a top pick. Yep, number seven. Brady House. Very nice. That's for the Washington Nationals. Great box right here. Gotcha. That's pretty... Well, the ranked top ten, that's pretty good. Let's look up quickly, really quick, Palmeiras. San Francisco Giants. Rhodes is an Oriole. Pacheco should be Detroit, but let me just double check. Yep, Detroit Tigers. Edward Perez is a Milwaukee Brewer. Montecato should be a Royal. Brady House is a national. Looks like a little kid. Anthony Gutierrez. Probably the high school kid, too, right? 22 out of 35. Andrew Painter, very nice. Billy's pitcher, right? Top pick for them out of 25. Russell Smith. James Wood.
Jordan McKent. And we got Samuel Munoz. To seven. That's right, Josh Giddy. Put it on TNT over there, Evan, right now. I said put it on 245. Samuel Munoz is also none. We'll double check, of course, to either you sign anywhere or like that, but also a none. Jordan McCants. Yeah, the, the future of the NBA looks, looks good. Like, the Rising Stars game is going to be pretty exciting. Uh, McCants is a Marlin. James Wood is a Padre. Russell Smith. Brewers. Terrence also is a nun, and he looks really young. I wouldn't doubt if he's a high school prospect or something. So we'll look this up at the end. So he's not signed to anybody. Thank you, George. I appreciate you guys helping me out. I'll double check those and probably put those on the video as well later so everybody knows. Christian Hernandez. Which should be Chicago Christian Hernandez, right? Carson Williams. To 15. Colson Montgomery. The two of two. Cooper, beef stew. Spencer Schwallenbach. Colton Kauser, very nice. Should be Baltimore, right? Three out of seven. Nice. Yeah, we'll double check all those again. Colton Callister should be Baltimore. Excuse me. 
Um, we have all of our pick your teams, random teams breaks on our website, buddy. If you want to click the link that's always dropping there, or like I said, you can go to jaspyscasebreaks.com. If there's anything you're interested, of course, it's right there on the website. So there it is. Thank you, Kev. Appreciate it. All right, looks like we'll be able to probably get that team random box done. It's done at two left, so by the time we get done with the Mac of the basket, uh, Mac of the soccer and stuff, I'll take a dinner break after the soccer break. But when we get back, we'll be able to do both of those uh, Donruss boxes. Wallenbach is a Atlanta Brave. We're almost done with this first case, guys. Like I said, this was going to take me a while. Uh, the Google Doc won't show you any money amounts of what it costs, Noah. The Google Doc is just for any breaks that are sold out. Any breaks that have any fillers, so you can know what potentially needs to fill f to sell out the main break, if that's what you're asking. All the prices for our breaks are on our website, jaspyscasebreaks.com. Google Sheet is just for like more info on breaks, schedule, any shipping, stuff like that. Colton is a White Sox. Carson Williams is a Ray. Christian Hernandez is a Cub. All right, three more boxes, guys. Hoglin Numbered out of four Gunnar Hoglin Ty Madden Out of five Tyler Black We have Averson Ortega And another Everson. One of one. I know, I just have to announce the names. I have to announce the players. Huh? Oh, you mean say it but don't write it on the tag? And you're going to do it? Sure, if you want. I mean, it still takes up time to look it up. Unless you want to just write it out. I have to write it out. All right, so I 
Ever since the San Francisco Giants, so that's a one on one, and then we had two of them back to back. So two San Francisco Giants. What you do? Tyler Black. Brewers. Tyler Black, Milwaukee Brewers. It's Chris Parent. Ty Madden is a Tiger. Two out of five. Gunnar Hogland is a Blue Jay. There you go, Blue Jay is going to uh, Michael. One out of four. And Tyler is a Houston Astro. Yeah, this break was going to take so long just because of that. And then I had two cases of it. So I was like, I already killed like 45 minutes doing this. See Josh Giddy, he's right there. Let's call Anthony. They play against the rookie? It's Rising Star, so it's like the first two years. Mega Bell, so everybody in the last year's draft class, or if they got invited, is there. Mega Bell, Irving Carter. Yeah, it's like a mixed team. Oswaldo Peraza. Yeah. Perdomo. Hiro, Palmeiras, three out of four, and Jackson Job, nice, number three overall pick, and I believe Jackson Job, Detroit, let me double check that, yep, Detroit Tigers. Yeah, it's basically like, like, uh, well, it's a mixed team actually now because Cole Anthony, usually it used to be like sophomores versus rookies, but now I think it's just a mixed team of both. Although I have like, years in the past, they'll do like international versus USA. There's another rookie out there. Of this year? Yeah. Or is Anthony Edwards? Um, I can't see right now who it is. Make a bell is Phillies. Make a bell. Phillies. Irving is a Blue Jay. Yeah. Oswaldo's a Yankee, numbered eight out of ten. Perdomo is a nun, but I think I think we talked about that earlier with this. I think he's over here too. Perdomo nun? No. But yeah, he's nun. Put nun, I'm gonna leave it over here. Let's have to look it up just to make sure. Alright. And we have a Pomeris is a giant. Yeah, it just came out today, Logan. I made one earlier. Yeah. Gavin Williams, Tommy Mace, Sal Frilick to 20, which is a Milwaukee Brewer. We have Ryan Kusnick, 
feel like an alarm is going off. Pedro Pineda, which is a Oakland Athletic. Or maybe the bank. Someone go rob the bank. And we got Benny Montgomery. Wait, what was this? A. Actually, that sounds like the bank. Like an I mean, somebody. It'd be stupid to rob it right now. It's a lot of people out. All right, let's see who these ones go to really quick. Gavin is a Cleveland Indian. Watch Cleveland Guardians now. Also could be a house. That's how Gary sounded like before. <gasps> Tommy Mace is another Cleveland Guardian. Ryan with the Braves. They like rob Chipotle. I mean, they're open, so I doubt it. <laughs> Rockies. Panic alarm. Rockies. No. All right, I don't know if Pro says exactly the same, but I know it's not gonna have licensing. So let's see what we got right here. No, Jazzy J. I'm an uh, employee, though. Been around since we pretty much almost first started it. Joe got hired, I think, like three months before I did. In late 14, and then I was uh, early 15. But no, the Jasperson family owns it. Perfect. Awesome, man. Sick. So it'll be after my dinner break. And also, let me adjust the time frame because we're going to be totally off. What time is it right now? 6.21. I probably won't be... Honestly, I probably won't be done until like... 7, maybe. So, we're going to have to push things a little back. So when I get back from my dinner break, we'll do that, uh, that rando. Huh? It was a car. Huh? It was a car. It was a car? Yeah, like, I don't know. Oh, man, it's the same thing. <laughs> what? Why can't you pack stack this? I do pack stack this, but I'm not going to pack stack all the cards together like that. Halliburton. You're gonna need more if you want. Right now you can open it up and get more pink ones or whatever. Yeah, it's just a little rough, right, Logan? <laughs> I know, man. It's because of the unlicensed stuff. We ha kind of have to do it on camera and announce it and stuff because then people be like oh 
I don't know whose card that is, and you know, how come you guys didn't announce it on the break? Now I have to look it up myself. We've had all those complaints before, so. It's just the searching, yeah, exactly. If, if, if it had logos on the back, I wouldn't have to do anything. <laughs> this one should be a little bit quicker, though, because a lot of these are more... I mean, there's still obviously some prospects, but there'll be a good mix of, like, actual players in the league. So, but yeah, the searching is what takes up this time-consuming break. That's what I was saying. I was like, it shouldn't take me more than, like, 45 minutes, but actually searching everything, uh, oh. you know, is, is what's taking a little bit longer. Yeah, the Series 1 random teams break would take me, like, 45 minutes, but I would have been done already. I've already, I'm in an hour into this video. Well, the thing is that Onyx might, might have a little bit of a licensing, so that's probably why they can do it. doing like a mini tournament of like rising stars because the championship game so they're saying that it's like a three game series kind of you vote the players in? well they're talking about like you can only vote for who's MVP during the championship game so it's like that means it's a tournament because they're only going to 50 which is probably like a quarter's worth of games yeah, and they're already like in the 30s, so. Who's winning right now? Isaiah? Isaiah, yeah. Is that the orange team? Go, Giddy. Where's Giddy from? He's Australian. Guys, actually, sorry. Before I start, let me pull up group A checklist again. But pull up pro set. See you guys. Have a good one. See you later, yeah, man. Peace. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, um, make sure that Chris is on the floor with you. So. Okay. Yeah. No. Whatever. Okay. Yeah. And then I'll tap in when I get here. Okay. And then no you way. and I can do it. Perfect. Cool. Pro set baseball. <laughs> oh. Actually, this is not going to be a good thing. I don't know if they have Pro Set on here. If Group Break Checklist does not have Pro Set, I am going to most likely have to skip the announcing of the names and stuff because it's just going to take me too long. Let me see. What year was this? 2021 Pro Set Metal. Yeah, that's so. This is the one thing I hate about it, but uh, it's gonna go to the teams they're currently on or teams they played for the longest. So it's gonna go by strictly all of these cards will definitely go by college rules. Um, damn it. So yeah, I'm just gonna. We'll have to just tag those later because it's gonna take too long. And that's what I'm saying, like, if Group Break can actually do all of these, I'd really appreciate it. But, obviously, like I said, sometimes um, they'll skip certain products because they have other things to do, like other checklists to upload. So, that's kind of the downside of, of this Group Break checklist. If they could do them all, we'd appreciate it very much.
All right, well, here, I mean, here's the Carbo Connection checklist, just so you guys can see who's potentially in here. But again, no teams will be affiliated, so like I said, we'll, we're definitely going to go college rules by this, and I guess we'll just tag these later. And if obviously, noticeable names and stuff like that we'll do right away, but we'll have to look these up later. It's like I recognize some of these names, but then I have to go look it up because I'm not too sure. Yeah, I'm not going to announce it, but... Alright, we got Tristan Casas. Number three out of seven. Like, yeah, where's Shohei Otani on? I gotta go look at that guy. Perdomo. Well, we do know that he's a nun, so... As long as he stays a nun, he, we'll still keep him as a nun. I think Tristan Casas was like a, I want to say Minnesota or like one of those teams, but I could be wrong, or Boston. So we'll keep this guy as a nun for sure. You know what, how about we just... Let's just keep it as Leaf. Let me see if Leaf Pro Metal literally almost has the same thing. Because it, it, it should be almost the same, basically. It's the same year. Yes, yes, yes. Let's keep it open. Let's see if it's actually there. Oh, wait. That's the wrong one. <laughs> I know, right? Yes, I had a feeling that with Tristan Costas was Boston. Unless you guys want to help me out. Other than that, then I'm just going to have to roll with it. I'm going to try to see if we can just use this. Since there is no official checklist, if uh, Leaf Metal actually ends up working out, then cool. If not, then oh well. See, like, Will Bednar is on Leaf Metal Baseball, so might as well just go with that, right? Giants. So he's on there. So I think that's what we'll end up doing. We'll just try to go by Leaf Metal Draft Baseball, in a sense. Unless we know it's a nun or obviously very something very uh, obvious. Because it's almost the same checklist, to be honest. Dalen. Four out of ten. Chase Petty. 5 out of 30. And Preciado. Reginald. Pro Set Prospects. Leaf XRC rookie to 35. So some of these guys are literally in the same checklist. So just make it easier. Might as well do it now. Chase Petty's a twin. Oh, sorry, I took it. And Preciado is a cub. And I guess I have to do this here because then I'm not going to know if there's a randomizer or not. Jalen's a Washington National Rookie Affiliate.
Jeff Jose Salas. Michael Harris the second. Carter Jensen. It's numbered four out of twenty. And this was number not numbered. Dylan Smith. Out of seven. Colson Montgomery. And very nice, Oscar Colas. You know that's a white sock. And Oscar Colas is not numbered? Oh, looks like it would have been numbered. Alright, so White Sock. White Sock for Colson Montgomery as well. Dylan Smith is a Tiger. Michael Harris is a Brave. Oh. What is it, Tide? Oh, someone's down by one? Carter Jensen is a Royal. Jose Salas is a Marlin. You need some right there. Open up this drawer. Oh, you gave it to me? Oh. Marlin? Yes. Where's the thing at? Oh, here it is. Ooh, they're challenging. All right, Derek Curiel. Tommy Mace. Number three, two out of three. Jefferson Quiero. He's a guy that looks like he draws like a bike. What happened? Who scored? Oh. Time added. The 25. I think Isaiah's trying to... Jose Rodriguez. Looks seven. like a one of one. No, a three out of five. And one of one, Maddox Bruns. Bruns is a Dodger. There you go. LA Dodgers going to Martin. I don't think this Jose Rodriguez is the same Rodriguez. There's so many Jose Rodriguez's. Yeah, it looks like that's our first one on one. Anybody know which Jose Rodriguez this is? It looks like he's wearing like a Venezuelan like jersey, but There's just like a couple Rodriguez's. 
I doubt this guy's a pitcher. Uh, the pitching hard Rodriguez. He has to be the Dodger, right? He's a shortstop. Actually. Okay, it has to be this guy. Yeah, this is this guy right here. Dominican Republic. Uh, Chicago White Sox. There you go. Sorry about that. Like I said, there's no checklist. We gotta look it up and try to get as official as possible. So Chicago White Sox for this guy. Ty Madden is a Detroit Tiger. Yeah, well, he's a second year. I know, but I thought because he made the... No, oh, he could do both. Brewers for Jefferson Quiero. Uh, skills is tomorrow. Today was just a celebrity game. I had to record it because I didn't get it to watch it. Jack Harlan, like those other people were there. Oh, I see that. Tommy Mace is an Indian or Guardian now, sorry. Um, Derek... Is a nun. I have to look this guy up. Oh. None. Every time you say that, I think like a real nun. I need no. Write it out. None. Oh. I need to make sure that these guys aren't actually affiliated with the team now. Just like whole us like last year, like last week. Oh. All right. Almost there, guys. Almost there. Waldo Peraza, shortstop there, three out of seven. Hedber Perez, number thirteen out of twenty. Ben Kudna, not numbered. Jordan McCants, Joe Mack, out of thirty, and Benny Montgomery. Defects RC. Benny's a Colorado Rocky. <laughs> Joe Mack is a Marlin. McCants is a Marlin. Rocky for Ben. Hedber Perez is a Brewer. Oswaldo is a Yankee. We got Jay Allen, Andrew Painter, which is a Philly, Phillies, Phillies, Adley Rutschman, there you go, that's a nice one right there, 16 out of 30, I don't know what number he is, but Baltimore Orioles, that's Martin, very nice, Jordan Walker, prospect there for the St. Louis 
Cardinals. Who is this one? Oh, uh, Baltimore. St. Louis. South for leg. Nice. We're getting all the names we recognize. That's great. That's another one there for the Brewers. And Blaze Jordan. Yeah, it looks like it's a Reds jersey. I can tell. Sometimes you can tell by the jersey, but then again, it's misleading because it might not even be there anymore. Blaze Jordan, that's number 10 out of 30. That's for the Boston Red Sox. And Jay Allen is a Rev. Thank you, Mike. Andrew Abbott, Gavin Williams, Marco Luciano, Khalil Watson, and nice, Robert Pawson, which is a Oakland Athletic, that is 15 out of 20. Now look at that. Jason Dominguez. That is a Pro Set Baseball Redemption. Card and level, including parallel, will be awarded at the time of fulfillment. So it could be a low numbered card. It could be not numbered. Depending on when you send it in. There you go. Jason Dominguez. Yankees. Can you bring me some top loaders? Maybe just like three of them. Yes, Marco Luciano is a giant. I know that. Gavin Will I mean, these guys, I recognize them again, but I just kind of forget. I think Gavin was a Brewer. No, he was a Cleveland, Cleveland uh, Guardian. Very who? Killing Indian. Red Sox for a bot. And Marlin for Khalil Watson. Oh, that's a good thing. All right, AJ Smith, Shalver, Ethan Wilson, Owen Cassie, Anthony Gutierrez, which Anthony Gutierrez was a nun. Nun. I'm just give it back to Marina. Robert Pawson, which is a Oakland Athletic. Yep. And a printing plate, one of one. Colton Kouser. Very nice. 
which I believe is Orioles. There you go. Cubs for Owen. Ethan is Phillies. Braves for AJ. Riley Green, Detroit Tigers, four out of six. Carson Williams. Rays. Red Batty, which I believe should be a Met. Let me double check really quick. Yep, Mets. Adrian Del Castillo. Diamondbacks. Peter Hubeck. Which is a Dodger. Washington, Senators, Nationals, and Harry Ford for Seattle, Mariners, Michael with the Mariners. Yeah. I want to go to all certain one of these years. Should be fun. But yeah, you have to do like the whole weekend, like Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Do you have packages? Jordan Wicks? Yeah, I mean, you got, I think you have to buy them all individually, but I'm sure you can. Alright, so Jordan Wicks. That's Chicago Cubs. Joe Rock. One out of five. Rockies for Joe Rock. Jose Miranda. Which is a Minnesota twin. And that's a blue out of 25. John Rhodes. John Rose is a Baltimore Oriole. Nick Gonzalez, which is a Pittsburgh Pirate. And Jordan Lawler, Diamondbacks. All right, guys, three more boxes. Three more boxes. Almost there. Jake Vogel, looks like he's a Dodger, but let me double check. Yep, Dodgers. Back to back Dodgers coming up. Wilman Diaz is coming up. This is a 2 out of 25, Jake Vogel.
Lonnie White. Lonnie White's a pirate. And we got Christian Hernandez. That is for the Cubs. Oh, this is a great box. Hey, some of these boxes actually are really nice. Man, look at this. Bobby Witt Jr. Four out of ten. Huh? I already gave it to you, isn't it? Christian Hernandez? Oh, that's right. Sorry. Bobby Wood Jr., 4 out of 10. That is a Kansas City Royal. And Brian Acuna. 1 out of 10, which I think we looked at Brian Acuna. I think he was still a nun. Yep. But we'll see if he actually signed with anybody already. Alright, two more boxes. Yeah, Kevin, you got in a couple of uh, Nick Gonzalez's already. The Valley Marte, which I believe should be a Marlin. Yep, no Marin. Mariner. I don't like that Michael Bratt. Or Mitchell Bratt, I should say. Texas Ranger. Grayson Rodriguez. Baltimore Orioles. That's a one out of seven. Ryan Holgate. Milwaukee Brewer. And that's a purple number 15 out of 25. Yolbert Sanchez. Out of 35. White Sox and Brady House, which is a Washington National. All right, last one here, guys. So again, I, I already updated the times. It's a 6:58. Yeah. I should be done with this within 15, 20 minutes. And I'll do the Immaculate Soccer Break that takes like 10 minutes. And then I'll take a dinner break around 8 o'clock. Or 7.30. So we're almost there, guys. And then I'll add the break that's sold out and all that to the schedule so you guys know. Doug Nick Hazy. Or Doug. Cleveland. Guardian. James Wood. Uh, was the Marte numbered? Seattle? Is that Seattle? Was it numbered? 13 out of 20. 13 out of 20. 10 out of 20. Padres for James Wood. Bruns, which I believe was a Dodger. Yep. Samuel Munoz. I believe Munoz was a nun, but I think 
Yeah, George said that he was already signed, but we'll we'll get back to that. We're not at the end. And it's kind of a lot of a repeat, so it's kind of good. We have Jackson Job. 32 out of 35. That is Detroit Tigers. And last one, Marcelo Mayer. Another Boston Red Sox right there. And try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. You just did my last favorite. Can you go back and just like take out the top of it? And I'll take out the other background. Okay. Alright, so we'll double check that these players aren't with the team anymore. If, or our team now, I should say. Because a lot of these are international slash high schoolers. If they're still in high school or going to college, no, nothing like that. Then they'll still be part of nuns and we'll just randomly give these out. Uh, might even give it out on one lot. We'll see. We'll figure it all out. I know. No, they didn't come again today, huh? The manager came today. Uh huh. And what did he say? Nothing. Nothing? Well, I don't know. I see him taking photos, and then I think Marion gave him a key. Didn't he? he said that he didn't come because they didn't have time. <laughs> so what? So we paid them for their service, but because they didn't have time, they're not gonna come to our business. Yeah. That's the dumbest shit. And then, uh, you know how they gave us a, a different. Dumpster? Yeah. But I guess they gave it to us because Mike's a veteran. Okay. Like, like a write-off. I don't know. Okay. Oh, okay. So he put it's down some the type of, you know, But then it's a smaller dumpster, though. Yeah, so Mike told I don't care what it says. I need a bigger dumpster. Yeah. That's crazy. crazy. Alright, guys. Hit parade and then flawless. Good luck. We got Edgar Martinez, 2 out of 10 for Seattle Mariners. Mariners is going to Michael. Four out of five, John Smoltz. From Definitive, Atlanta Braves. Mad dude, that one. Nolan Arenado for Colorado. 5 2 Fino. 17 to 25. Colorado Rockies, that is going to Martin. Nice, Jordan Alvarez. 61 out of 70, and that's a rookie from Inception Baseball. BGS 910. Houston Astros, that is going to Jose. What's up? That's way? Over there. Oh, one. Thank you. All right, thank you to my wife right there. Really helped us out a lot, actually. Now we would have still been tagging. Salvador Perez, 17 out of 25. Kansas City Royals. Martin with that one. Reese Hoskins for the Phillies. Clubhouse Collection. Out of 25. Phillies. Going to Brandon Hall. Nice. There you go. And Dylan Carlson, 26 out of 50. St. Louis Cardinals going to Anthony Venturino. And Bryce Harper, how about that? Look, old school dynasty right there. 2014, 4 out of 10. Washington Nationals, Bryce Harper edition. 9, 5, 10, what a great grade. 
So Washington Nationals edition is Joe Vent. All right, last two here, guys. This has been a pretty good case right here. Hip Raid Baseball is always pretty solid, though. Manny Machado. Number 21 out of 125. Padres. And a Martin. And we have Daryl Strawberry. 26 out of 35. New York Mets. Mets going to Michael. Alrighty, guys. Sweet. That was a pretty awesome case, if you ask me. All right, let's end it off with a bang, guys. Flawless. Let's go. I know middle card it looks like, but a thick, thick box right here though. Card is like sticking out basically. All right, good luck, everybody. We have a Ken Boyer, 4 out of 10. And that is St. Louis, that one. Whoa, one of one, all Joes. Joe Medwick, Joe Sowell, and Joe Cronin. Uno of Uno. Wow, this is going to be a randomizer, all right? St. Louis, Cleveland, and Boston. So St. Louis would be Anthony. Cleveland would be Martin. And Boston would be Bobby. Very nice. Little old school players right there. That's kind of cool. Legends. Ian Anderson, beautiful patches, 7 out of 20, Atlanta Braves. Don Manity, 3 out of 7. Donnie Baseball for the Yankees, that's Aaron. And we have for Tampa Bay, Taylor Walls, 1 out of 7. Rookie patch autographs or rookie patch signatures. We have Joe Carter, five out of fifteen for Toronto. Michael with that one. We have Spencer Torkelson, fifteen out of fifteen for Detroit going to Martin. That's sweet. Pork. And last one here is Dylan Carlson. Rookie signature autographs for St. Louis. Going to Anthony. Alrighty, guys. Good luck. Ryan Mountcastle, 16 out of 25. Rookie autographs for the Baltimore Orioles. O's, that is going to Martin. Beautiful. 
And last one here. Ooh, purple. Three out of four double diamond Yerman Mercedes for the White Sox going to Steven Flat. Very nice. Very nice. Alrighty. There we go, guys. Awesome. So definitely have this randomizer for sure between those three teams. Let's quickly separate these guys because a couple of them are actually the same ones. So this guy came back twice to so this guy. This guy was a one. All of these guys are actually doubles. Let's quickly look that up. So. Oh man, this Derek dude is literally young as hell. This dude's like a graduate in 2024. How the hell is this kid signing already? Committed to LSU, isn't that crazy? That's wild. Uh, well, obviously this is gonna be randomized for sure. Dude's in high school. Gutierrez, I think, is Rangers. Yes, Texas Rangers. Let's just put that here now. So let's go to a team. I thought Brian Acuna was signed already, but... Looks like he hasn't signed yet. Uh, this is the Twins are the favorite to sign him, but doesn't look like doesn't look like he signed yet because his only only his brother, of course, is with the Texas Rangers. So I think that's gonna stay as is. Oh, wait, sorry, no, sorry. He is signed with the Twins, actually. It says Twins, Ron Acuna, signed Junior, Ron... Okay. 
So ministers have finalized the latest class of international process. Brought on the top talent available. Cool. Acuna has been signed, actually. Back in January 17th, 2022. There we go. For the twins, nice. Mark. Uh, I don't, re I don't remember how many hits the Angels got in all the Leaf products, man. Because those are the main chases right there, or those are the main hits where teams are actually gonna hit a lot. But uh. I can see after this break, man. I think you did much better with the Red Sox, man. Trust me. The Red Sox with Marcelo Mayers in there was crazy. Samuel Munoz is now a Dodger, actually. Signed free agent. Samuel Munoz to a minor league contract on January 15th. Nice. So, LED right here. And those, yeah, Blaze Jordans, too, was another one that was there. You're right. All right, so for sure that guy and Jose Perdomo is the last one. Uh, and I think this Jose Perdomo is actually a, a child. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's uncommitted in college. He's in high school right now. Uh, so this will also be randomized here. So, um, that's a six out of ten. How about this? We'll just go. All right, how about this? Number one gets this Derek dude because he's actually going to college. And then this number two gets these two. We'll just we'll just pair them up. You can start your Perdomo and Curiel PCs. <laughs> so number one gets both of these. Number two gets those two. And then obviously we'll do like a randomizer for this one-on-one. -on -one. Sorry, guys. I mean, like I said, it's a little rough with this stuff like this. But we got it done, guys. We're done, though. All right, so let's switch scenes. Like, they used to have, like, photos of him as a little kid. It's like when, like, he was, like, 13. But, I mean, hey, man, he must be pretty good. All right, so everybody will have a shot at these ones here, and we'll just randomize by customer name. Yeah, dude. It's crazy, right? this guy ever become somebody imagine you had like his like autograph when he was like 14 <laughs> and then of course this triple relic of course is affiliated with teams so we'll put Cardinals uh, Guardians and Red Sox all right good luck guys yeah, man, they're making some money, right? Six and a one, seven times. Good luck. Top two, get those extra cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, and six and a one, seven. I know, right? You're going to high school. You're like, hey, man, I, I just actually won your cards at, in a group right with Jaspies. <laughs> you're just like, cool. All right, so Steven, you're going to get the Derek Kriels. So since he's actually committed to, like, college already, I'll go to you, Steven.
And Marin, you're gonna get the Jose Perdomos. Alrighty guys, well thank you guys so much. I know that was a long griller break. So now let's do the last randomizer and again, good luck. This is a triple 101 relics. Six and a one seven. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Boom! Stays with the Guardians at the top. Guardians of the Galaxy. So Cleveland, Joe Sowell wins that battle. And Cleveland is going to Martin. Congratulations, man. Well deserved, man. I know you put some... Uh, really, really try to get this break done yesterday. So congratulations. Cleveland wins that one. And there you go, guys. Appreciate it. Jaspies, CaseBreaks.com.